A business in Northwest Houston not only gives old trophies new life, but also helps young adults with disabilities. Channel 2's Chip Brewster went to the business on FM 529 near North Eldridge Parkway for a closer look. If you're like me, somewhere in your house, there's a box of old trophies, whether they're for different sporting events or the 1987 South Padre Island beer drinking king. What do you do with them? Do you hold on to them, throw them out? I've got another option. Disassemble. Sort. Clean. Reuse. If you donate your old trophies to Revive Glory Awards, not only will parts of them find new life, you'll be helping these young adults with disabilities make a life for themselves. Mark is nonverbal, and so it's very difficult for him to communicate with just everybody in the population. About four years ago, Sharon Meaden was searching for a way to keep her son engaged in life after graduating high school. That's when she stumbled across an old box of trophies and found many of her friends had similar boxes. We just decided it was right to start a business and to give them an environment to use their skills and find out what else they could learn. She came to me and opportunity knocked at the door and I was hired. Trophy master and laser operator Foster Thompson knew Mark and his mom through Special Olympics. He was one of the first employees hired and appreciates being able to work with his peers. I think it does make it like more that we belong. I mean, not that I felt like I don't belong, but you know, it, it's nice to see that there's people like me that have disabilities. I can challenge my skills as such as wagering and coining bases, and I like the aspect of learning. So whether you've got trophies to donate or you're in the market for handing out some awards, you can find more information on Revive Glory at click2houston.com. In Northwest Houston, Chip Brewster, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Oh,